friends and supporters. Uh, this is our hope. I'm so excited to be invited in your house uh, with a brand new video. And this video today has for title Natural Ways to Keep Your Prostate Healthy. And just before I start the uh, video, I want to take this time to thank you for inviting me inviting me in your house and also to thank you for subscribing to the channel and share it with all your friends so and ask your friend to subscribe as well and also to share it with all their contacts so before i start the video i want to take a short break and I'll be right back. Stay tuned. Now I am back after the break and thank you for stay for still connected. As I mentioned earlier. The title of this video, Natural Ways to Keep Your Prostate or How Prostate Healthy. Prostate is one of the most important parts of our reproductive system. A healthy prostate and well functioning is what every male, every male preferred. Having an enlarging prostate doesn't mean how we will have more or worse symptoms because it's different from one person to another. But it can be large, it can become large as we, we age. And by the age of 50 and up and older, we might feel some sign in passing our urine. There are several factors that affect our prostate health that we cannot change, such as age, ethnicity, and family stories at the same ways or at the same times there are things we can do to promote our positive health here is a list of what we can do first eating more vegetables and fruits. Vegetable and fruits contain many vitamins, minerals, and fiber, antioxidant, and phytochemical nutrients. In combination, this nutrient may help keep her posted healthy naturally it contain about uh, it is uh, recommended to eat five and up services of uh, vegetable and protein in a daily basis choose them from all colors such as green, yellow, or orange, red or purples, and white to get a more variety of prostate healthy phytochemical. Example, we can eat tomatoes, watermelons, guaya, guayava, or pink, uh, pink grapefruit. 
as a food and as vegetable we can eat also broccoli Brussels sprouts cauliflower garbage or cabbage collard green and kale both example promote a prostate and have overall second eat more legume and whole grain legumes are in are high or rich in folate potassium iron magnesium and fiber you can add them to stews, casseroles, soup, salad, or make a side dish with your with her favorite spices. Soybeans are good to keep her person healthy as well, such as tofu, so, soy milk, and etc. etc. It is recommended to eat them so that her prostate can be healthy. Also, eat more unprocessed whole grain, such as uh, oats, brown rice, barley and quinoa they are rich in vitamin b vitamin e and fiber they will keep her posted healthy naturally also next we can eat uh, is a limit red meat and dairy the study shows that eating a lot of red meat or dairy is not healthy for the post for the prostate for her prostate. We need to avoid eating too much processed meat meat as well, such as, such as bologna, salami sausage bacon and hot dog they all can affect her posted health in the long term also calcium is good for her bone but too much of it can affect her posted we need to eat no more than 1000 milligram of calcium daily and for that reason we need to reduce the quantity and the amount of dairy product that we consume so it is recommended to eat no more than one service uh, uh seven dairy per day And we get this uh, as uh, as dairy product. It could be milk, it could be cheese, and it could be any other thing that made with with milk. Those are dairy product, everyday product. Also, next stop we can take is eat more fatty feet fish and nuts fish is a healthy and natural alternative to red meat fattier fish such as salmon mackerel herring trout uh, swordfish contain omega-3 such as other nuts like 
nuts, especially Brazilian nuts, contain also uh, fatty acid. And they could also they contain omega-3. They are good for her health, uh, healthy heart, as well as for to keep her prostate healthy. Eat more of them to and up in a weekly basis, they will keep her prostate in a good health. Other thing we can do uh, what they call drink green tea. Green tea may play an important role in her prostate health. Drinking three to four cups of green tea a day per day is more beneficial. Also, we can eat other things um, uh, beside the we can drink caffeine or the caffeine how preference will determine what will take some people they cannot to take too much caffeine they need the, the caffeine uh, also people like and their body go, uh, go with uh, caffeine they can take uh, caffeine tea uh, to drink also they can use pomegranate they are good for prostate the juice and also they need to drink a lot of water when i say a lot of water not uh, uh over what they recommend daily but they need to drink a lot of, uh, a lot of water and they basically uh eight to ten cup of water a day and also the honey help her posted so if we do that we are in a good way to have a healthy posted. Most thing we can, uh, other thing we can do is uh, to maintain how uh, a healthy posted to watch her weight. Maintaining a healthy body is important not only for her overall health but also for her posted uh, health. So we need to watch how we, what we eat, how much we eat, and that's why, uh, and what we eat, especially, they recommend to eat two, two thirds, uh, what they refer to for the new American uh, uh, plate guideline, is recommend to eat two thirds of a plate contain vegetable and whole grain, and one third or less who can eat what they call meat or poultry so if we go there is good in the uh, two third it could be vegetable it could be food it can be whole grain and beans they all are good for to keep half roasted uh, good and the meat, as I mentioned, it could be red meat or it can be uh, poultry. It also, it could be fish too. Other thing to keep her prostate in good health is exercise regularly. They recommend we uh, daily exercise and physical activities are essential for prostate health. They release tension decrease the stress keep hormone health uh, level healthy and improve her immune function so i swear training uh, help improve muscular strength and performance decrease fatigue and improve quality of life so keep us busy do exercise it will be good for her overall health and also for her posting at least they recommend to uh, do about three, um, 30 minutes exercise or activity daily, physical activity daily five days a week and you all we need to keep ourselves in good health.
in good health. Other thing they recommend is herbs. They say yes, there are some herbs that can be beneficial for uh, in this journey of our posted health. They have anti-inflammatory properties that help uh, to strengthen enlarge prostate and also contribute to a healthy prostate such as, uh, such as uh, turmeric, ginger, cayenne pepper, etc. And other thing we can do if we smoke, it is recommended to quit smoking because smoke is not good overall for our health and also it is our fair our prostate health. And other thing uh, they recommend uh, to do is uh, stop consuming alcohol or too much alcohol. It's not good overall for her health and also for her prostate. <coughs> other thing they recommend uh, us to do uh, is not to consume too much energy drink. Uh, if we do <clears throat> at the beginning, it could be okay. Sorry, but if we do too much uh, uh, on the long term, it will affect how how health. So stop consuming too much energy drink. In conclusion, <clears throat> eat fresh and healthy food is the key to keep us. Uh, have a healthy prostate. Keep her prostate healthy by eating a diet rich in food and, and, uh, and vegetables, in whole grain, green tea, and fatty fish, while limiting meat and dairy consumption as we exercise and maintain a healthy body weight. So we will benefit a posted healthy lifestyle style. For, so for more information, you will find me on Facebook, on Instagram, and on Twitter. That's all I have I bring you today regarding how to maintain a healthy posted. I hope this video will help you as you make the change to have a long, long, long term, a long way, long term, good lifestyle without any symptom or chronic disease. That was your Uncle Po who brought you those information in this video. Be still connected for next video and I will see you soon. Bye-bye.